Hello my loves, welcome back to another weekly vlog, happy Monday. It's actually 5.30 and I haven't spoken to you yet just because I was absolutely exhausted this morning. I woke up and I was so tired, I just felt like I wasn't with it. And I, well I need to, I'm trying to get hold of Tom but he's obviously quite busy at work so I need to see if he phoned the garage about my car. I said in the end of the last weekly vlog that my car was having a few issues so we were going to try and get it booked into the garage tomorrow. So because of that, because there's a few issues, I drove my car back and forth, but I didn't want to risk driving it multiple times. So I didn't come home on my lunch break, which is why I'm only talking to you now. And so I hope you're okay. Happy Monday. I've been trying to upload my vlog all week and it's actually going really quick now. I'd left, because obviously I wasn't coming home, I thought I don't want to leave my laptop on charge because I'm just a paranoid person. I didn't want to leave it on charge all day, so I thought I'll take it to work with me. And it's been on charge since half seven this morning, like uploading a video. Has it uploaded? No, but it is being quite quick now. So hopefully it should go up by tonight. I got home and I've got two parcels, so I thought we could open them together and then I need to work on the tubs for dinner. I'm also still shattered, so I'm going to make myself an iced coffee, so I thought we could have one together. But yeah, let's see. So we've got something here from Benefit, so let's see. We've got, and then I've got a little parcel from Face Theory as well. Oh, so we've got a new, they're real magnums, that. 36 hour lengthening. Mascara with a magnetic force that draws lashes out to extreme lengths. Interesting. I love a Benefit mascara, as you know. That's why I always use. So this is what this one looks like. So we can try this out next time we do our makeup. Interesting. They're real magnet mascara. Okay. And then the other box is, I think this is like a little PR mailer from Face Theory. They did email me. And it did say it's been delivered. So let's have a look. So this is what it looks like. Face Theory, the Sustainable Skincare Standard. So this is the their new Serenite Night Oil, Night Oil O12. It's the ultimate multi-restore night face oil for health of the, for, I can't speak, firmer skin. With natural ingredients, suitable for all skin types. So yeah, this is the night oil. So maybe we can test this out tonight in our evening skincare routine. Thank you very much, Faith Theory and Benefit. I don't know what to have for dinner tonight. Let's see what goes out of date first. That's what I normally do. What is the date today? The 11th. Yeah. So, let's have a look. Let's see what's going on. So, I'll probably do either fajitas or fish cake. I'm kind of feeling like fish cake with. Potato wedges and sweet corn for a nice, easy meal. So I think I'm going to have that. But yeah, I'm going to make myself an iced coffee because I'm so tired and I need to wake up. I don't know what pods do today. Should we try a different one? Obviously, we've, I want to do the little double tap thing again. So obviously, we've tried vanilla and we've tried um, whatever the other one was. What was it? It was like the special edition one, wasn't it? So maybe we'll try golden caramel, make a caramel kind of like ice macchiato. So I'm going to go ahead and make that and I'll give you a little taste test afterwards. Coffee made. Let's give it a stir. I don't know if I need some more milk. Let's try. Super nice. Gonna add a splash of milk. Yeah, it's really good. I'm really enjoying that the ice cookies at the moment. They're really good. So yeah, Tom's on his way home, so I'm gonna make fish cakes tonight. Just because it's just quick and easy today, but I need to have a little bit of a clear out, I need to empty the dishwasher and stuff. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that. And then he said there's a Chelsea game tonight. So while he's watching that, I'm going to wash my hair and do a bit of a cut-off. So I think that's kind of the plan for this evening. But yeah, I'm just going to go ahead, watch some YouTube and get a bit of sorting out going on around here. Okay, so it's 8 o'clock. Tom's about to watch a Chelsea game. So I normally wash my hair on Monday, so I'm going to go ahead and do that now. I'm going to use the usual Matrix Mega Sleek range. Um, and my little... Sunday Body Whip, I've got an exfoliator from Sunday Rain as well that I'm going to use. I need to exfoliate where I get laser as well, so I keep forgetting to do that. So yeah, just going to do that, get into my dressing gown, and then I'm going to do a little bit of the course. That's kind of the plan, but yeah, let's just wash my hair. This is the second time I'm going to have washed it since I had it cut, so let's get freshly washed hair. I'm really in the wee though, so I'm going to do that first. Okay, so it's 10 o'clock. 
Tom has finished the football game. I've just been chilling and I did a little bit of a course. Um, and yeah, now I'm just scrolling on my phone. But we're gonna go upstairs. I used my new springtime scent from the floor and it tasted. It smelled really nice. <laughs> Um, I uploaded my weekly vlog, so that's our ninth weekly vlog this year, so super exciting, so that's gone up. Um, so yeah, I need to try and get the shop with me up this week as well. Um, but yeah, I'm just so tired, so I'm going to head to bed, and obviously I'll be up early in the morning. I'll make sure we have a little chat in the morning, because obviously we didn't speak this morning. Um, but yeah, we had fish cakes, mashed potato, and sweet corn for dinner, and it was really yummy. Um, yeah, I'm going to head to bed now, so I'll speak to you in the morning when it's Tuesday. Good morning, happy Tuesday. It's currently half six. This is what my hair's looking like. I haven't straightened it, but it feels really, really soft. I put some hair oil on it and it feels really nice. I forgot to make my lunch yesterday because basically we didn't, so Tom phoned up the garages, but we haven't actually booked in yet because um, the lights weren't coming on yesterday. This chicken is so gross i might see if that house um, i just i'm not gonna buy this chicken again i know it's the cheap chickens it's my own fault really but just it hasn't been very great this time i'm just gonna have to keep ripping it apart and having like a good look at it because it just there was some really dodgy part in my bagel yesterday and i was in a fan but anyways um it didn't come on yesterday but i'm still being cautious because obviously there's obviously something wrong with it we just so we're gonna book it either towards the end of the week or take it on saturday morning um but for now i'm just gonna have my lunch breaks at work because at least then i'm only driving two times a day and my journey's like so short so it doesn't it takes me about seven to eight minutes to get home and back so it's only yeah like I'm driving for 60 minutes and it didn't come on the oil light didn't come on all yesterday so I mean I've got to have my lunch break at work anyway today because I've got to do the other half of the course I was doing last week um so I'm gonna go ahead and do that so I'm gonna take it pretty much as my break and just have a little bit extra of like my own time I have to like talk and it's so embarrassing let me just get everything ready I've made my lunch I've got a chicken bagel some fruit, banana chips, dried mango, and then I've just put a couple extra snacks in, so I don't know what time I'm there to, and I might get a bit hungry. It was be better to pack more than less. And I've also just made my breakfast, got the same as usual, yogurt, granola, bananas, and blueberries. I'm also gonna have some grapes on the side. I'm having some apple juice. I had a really exciting email this morning for a club coming up, so I'm gonna email them back, it's so exciting. I'll say, I won't tell you yet, I'll wait till it's come through, but obviously I'll let you know. Um, yeah, I'm really excited about it. So, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and eat my breakfast, reply to the email, watch some YouTube. And, yeah, I'm feeling a bit tired. I've got a bit of a headache this morning, so I might need to go find my glasses wherever they may be hiding. Um, so I can feel it in my eyes. So, yeah. So, I was going to do, like, a let's test out some new skincare products, but I'm in such a rush. So, I don't have time to go find them all and do, like, a proper testing. Um, so, we can do it later. Because I've got the new toner. I don't know if we've tested this together or not. I feel like we might have, but I thought we could use this. I'll use the hand cream this morning. We can see what that smells like. So I'm trying to get into hand cream because um, obviously I think like your hands age first. So I'm really trying to look after them. Um, so you can try the grey for cold one. And then obviously I got that new facial oil yesterday. I've got some, to be fair, it's probably better to do it at night anyways. I've got like a night cream and a few, I've got quite a few night products. So this evening we can do our skincare together and try out some new products, which I think will be fun. Um, because at the moment I literally have five minutes and I still need to brush my teeth as well. So I feel like I'm always running behind. It's just normal now. But I always manage to make it on time. So I think I'm just used to it. I just need to try and get up, up a little bit earlier, I think. But yeah, it's meant to be raining all day, which is so annoying. I want to try and do a little workout later, depending on what time I get home. Um, I know I've got to stay, I just don't know what time till yet, so I'll have to wait and see. But yeah, as like I said, I'm not going to be coming home on my lunch break, so I feel like this vlog could be a bit shorter this week, because I'm not really talking to you at lunch. Um, yeah, I want to try and do something exciting this weekend, I don't know what to do. We don't have any plans, but I kind of just want to go somewhere, like, I don't know whether to go to the beach, or 
something like that like go to Bournemouth or go to Brighton or something so I might speak to Tom I don't know what's the weather meant to be like this weekend depends on that really so I don't really want to go in the pouring rain because the wind will just blow the wind rain in your face Saturday's 13% no 30% rain Sunday's actually cloudy and it says 16 degrees that's the hottest it is this week and I feel like when it hasn't been like windy and rainy and it's been 10 degrees like last week it was actually quite warm so if the weather's like actually nice as well I feel like that 16 degrees is going to be really nice weather so maybe we I might talk to Tom and we'll keep an eye on the weather and we could possibly go down to the beach because we don't have to spend any money like we could bring our own lunch if we want to and I think it would just be nice to get away get somewhere go somewhere else you know be in a different area I think that could be fun so yeah I'll let you know the plan when I'll no, I yeah, love putting the SPF one adds so much glow. Love it. And then let's try out this little hand cream. I always just rub my hands into my product. Into my, rub my, I literally can't speak this morning. Rub my products into my hands because obviously, like I said, your hands apparently age first. So any, moisturis any moisturisation they can get, I definitely add. But this is the Grace Curl Hand and Nail Cream Blossom and Grapefruit. Just put it on my hand. Oh, that smells really good. I love a nice smelling hand cream. Yeah, really trying to get into this, at least putting it on once a day just to keep my hands looking super young and fresh. But yeah, it's seven o'clock, so I need to leave in five minutes. So I'm gonna go ahead and brush my teeth and head to work. She needs to do my eyebrows and eyelashes like I normally do. But yeah, it's so sad that I'm not coming home on my lunch break, but like I said, I don't want to risk my car having a big issue so at the moment it's been driving okay we'll see what happens today um maybe i'll try and bring my camera in the car we can do a little bit of singing or a little chat in the car actually so i'll bring it with me i won't probably do one this morning because it's still a bit dark outside um but maybe when i'm on my way home we can have a little chat depending on how dark it is like i said because i don't know what time i'm staying till tonight i never know it's just kind of the unknown at the moment I think for dinner tonight we're going to have fajitas because Tom really wanted them last night but I just wasn't really in a fajita mood. So yeah, I'll speak to you after because I'm just going to be late. Good evening, it is just turned 5.30 um, so I had to stay to the end. So the light is not that great and it's probably a little bit rattly. Um, yeah, I'm very tired because yeah, I did an extra hour and 15 today. So very tired, obviously you've got to stay again tomorrow. It's just going to be a very tiring week i'm ready for everyone to be back from their holidays so i can just actually have a short day we can have like a little catch up together we can get things done in the evening but i uh, said so we're gonna have fajitas tonight which is quite an easy dinner um so yeah that's quite easy i don't know if tom's already on his way home because sometimes like he already is so i'll have a look once we get home but i think i'm gonna make myself um a little matcha that's what i feel like tonight is my little drink of choice i love treating myself to a little drink after work especially when it's been a bit crazy and i've been you know staying over time just wakes me up and makes me feel good um i did my little senko course which was okay but he did say at the end like if we're gonna be like a proper sen senko then we need to do more training so i need to look more into it um yeah so i'm about five minutes away from home so i will speak to you as soon as i'm back okay so i'm back at home i've just made myself a matcha tom is just leaving but we're having fajitas for dinner and they only take like, like 10 minutes so i'm just gonna give myself a chance to chill i'm gonna chill my matcha i put some youtube on because he's gonna be home like over an hour so i'm gonna reply to some emails and some dms and yeah just chill for a little bit and um, drink my matcha Put some vanilla milk in it and vanilla syrup. Super yummy. So that is the plan for the next hour or so. I'm just gonna cut up the pepper. Tom is about 20 minutes away. So I'm just gonna get everything ready. Um, and yeah, we literally just, we always just have pepper. We have beef stir fry strips. We have, we should put some of them. With the seasoning, we add some like egg. we get the barbecue. This is the one we got. Yeah, I get the actual branded one. We just picked up this one, so we always get barbecue. And we add like extra 
barbecue seasoning and then we just add some cheese and that is literally it so i'm gonna go ahead cook that i've just been chilling watching some youtube i drank my matcha it was really nice um so yeah let's do this tuesday dinner okay so it's nine o'clock we've come upstairs because tom has got a i don't know some exam -y thing coming up for his work um so he wants to do some revision and we just thought we'd come upstairs so i've reset the kitchen i've cleared it all I'm trying to keep up with that each night because it just makes you feel so good in the morning when i come down and everything's just where it needs to be it's all clear and i've got like no mess in my way when i'm making breakfast and i especially wanted to do it tonight because i don't know what it is about like cooking meat and like especially like fajitas and things like it just stinks and yeah i just need to get rid of the smell obviously i said we could do some skincare together try some new products i've also got some products i haven't used for a while so i thought we could just try some products we haven't used for a while and have a little chat so in my little bathroom i'm going to use the cerave hydrating cleanser now i actually have a question because you know when like with like my Elemis cleanser, it says to apply to dry skin and like you rub it into your makeup. But this one says onto wet skin. So I literally normally just get a bit of water and like dab it on my skin. But is that like what I'm meant to do? <laughs> I don't know. But I'm just putting a few squirts on and then making kind of like a little lavery. I'm putting it on the skin. I'm actually pushing my hair back. These little things are perfect. I got them on oh, TikTok shop, I think, and they just stop the water running down your arms. And then, obviously, this headband just keeps my hair out my face. But I'm trying to get better at cleansing. I always cleanse now instead of like using my cellar water, which get a funnel, um, when I have makeup on. But when it comes to like days when I don't, I forget. But I feel like I probably should because where I work with children and Especially like an outdoor environment, I've probably got so much mud and stuff all over my face. So yeah, I'm trying to get better at cleansing. But I thought if we do our skincare together, I feel like we haven't had like a little proper like chatty skincare for a while. So I thought, why not? I'm just gonna rub that off and dry my face, then we can do a little bit of a toner. Okay, now my skin is all fresh and clean. I'm gonna go with a toner. I'm actually getting sent a few more things from them. They reached out to me the other day, so I'm really excited to try. I think the packaging is so cute. This is the brand Coat, and this is their Gentle Hydrating Toning Milk. Um, it's got manzanic acid, vitamin C, hyaluronic acid, niacinamide, and ceramide, which exfoliates to boost skin radiance and help prevent breakout and helps protect skin's moisture. And I've never tried this, a toning milk. I did use this the other day. I can't remember if I did it on the blog or in a TikTok, but... Yeah, I do love trying new products, but it is literally like a cut. I don't think you'll be able to tell. Hold on. It literally, what can I show you? I don't think you can see. It literally comes out like a moisturiser. That's what it looks like. Like it just doesn't look like your usual like wet toner. But you know, it's something new. So I'm just going to spread that around the face, especially in the breakout areas. And then we can head into the dressing room. Or should we do the rest in here actually? Because it's like a different location. I feel like the lighting's really good as well. So I might go and grab some other bits and bring them in here. But yeah, that's the little toning milk, which is really nice. So I've got two other products that I haven't used before. And then I obviously found this serum that I used to use, the Fresh Tea Elixir. I just want to try it. I've got so many different serums. So I feel like I need to like change them up sometimes. And I used to love this one. So I thought we could use this this evening. I've obviously got my eye cream, got my... Got over for a lash serum, which is definitely working 100%. Like, my lashes are growing so much. I definitely recommend this. Yeah, I have linked it on TikTok shop, but obviously you can just buy it online. Um, but yeah, I got sent the Face Face Theory Serenite Night Oil. I looked up when to put it on, um, and it says to use a facial oil as your last step in your, make, in your skincare routine. So we'll put that on last. And then I've also got the... Ella and Joe Relax and Renew Night Cream. Let's have a look. So, let's see. It stimulates skin renewal, plumps up lines, wrinkles, and hydrates the skin while you sleep. And this is what she looks like. Super cute. So, obviously, we're going to go with the serum first. We're going to go in with the Fresh Beauty. But yeah, I'm really trying to stay on top of my skincare I feel like I'm really good at it in the morning now I do it every morning I just struggle at night if we come up quite early and I haven't got anything particular to do 
I always remember to do it. But I feel like if we come up at like 10 and I'm like shattered, I'm just like, I can't be bothered. But I need to just stay on top of it. It's more for like my future skin, you know. Obviously doing these steps now will obviously help my skin in the future. So that's the main reason I need to remember. I've got my Symbiosis eye cream. I always say in my vlogs, but I never know like when an eye cream is good. So if you've got an eye cream that you think is generally really good, let me know. Like, I've got a few, but I haven't ever been like, oh, like, I've noticed like a really big di difference from using it. So I don't know if it is like any of these actually do anything, but I just add it anyway to get a bit of moisturisation, especially because I'm just so tired at the moment doing overtime i'm so ready for next week where hopefully i'll be back to my normal shifts because i just want to have like a nice little chat with you guys obviously let me know like any videos and things i need to edit the shop with me actually so i want to get that up either tomorrow or thursday so i'm gonna do a bit of editing in the morning i think but yeah let's open this little bella and joe i've never heard of this brand that smells really nice you know something like skincare that just smells really like spa like that's what this smells like but i do feel really good after i've done my skincare so it's definitely worth it at the end i might try and come home on my lunch break tomorrow because um my oil light hasn't been coming on so and like i said i only work five minutes away so if something was to happen like it's not come like i've driven miles away so I might do that because I miss like just having lunch at home mainly because I just like getting some jobs done around the house and I like watching YouTube whereas when everyone's in the office like I'm actually not going to sit and watch YouTube I'm just going to let that dry and um, it smells really nice so yeah I always want to start using I think I'm putting in a vlog before my pretty perfect planner cleaning planner thing just to stay on top of the cleaning because sometimes like it gets to like Thursday and I'm like I feel like I cleaned the living room sides but like, I don't know it's only if that was last week I'm so forgetful so yeah I'll just start writing just writing everything down and then I can highlight it on that week so I might start writing that out so maybe we can write that quickly tonight before we go to bed so we've kind of got like a little schedule of all the kind of cleaning jobs we need to get down through the week so I used it for a few weeks before and it was so helpful just to like stay on top of the house. This is the facial oil. I know these are really good to use gua shots with. I do have one but I don't know where it is. Um, so maybe I could look into a little gua sha routine because that's meant to be really good for structuring your face. I'll get this open. Let's see. Add a few drops. What does it actually say? I think it's just, just to add like extra moisturisation. What does it say on here? It doesn't really say what it's for. It's got a ceramide in. But we'll just add it to the routine. And obviously at my go through a serum, like I said, I've definitely noticed a difference. And like when I was with my mum, she's the one that like made me notice the most. Because like in the morning when I got ready on Sunday, I was looking in the mirror and I was like, my lashes do look long. But she was like, no, they're actually like noticeably long because she thought I'd had like extensions on the thing. And I was like, no. And I was looking at them in the mirror and they were literally touching my eyebrows. So I'm so proud of them because I don't like wearing like falsies and I don't like having lash extensions. Like, I've done that all before and it's just uncomfortable. My eyes get really itchy. So the fact that I can have like my lashes like this and they look really nice, I'm really proud of that, so I'm going to keep up with it and we'll see how long they get really. Um, but I also, one of the ladies in beauty boxes had this Voca Dreams of Africa pillow spray. I thought we could spray this, look how bougie it is. It's like a little perfume, but um, it just smells so like relaxing. Like, you know those kind of scents, like you know when you just have like a, um, those hot water bottles like when you were little and they were like scented? I like really relaxing and I thought this will help us get to sleep. I mean I sleep easily but Tom sometimes needs help so I thought I'll spray this on the pillows but I'm gonna literally stay out watching YouTube. I need to start reading again really. Um so I think I'm gonna start again this week but where I haven't been on my break, I haven't really been catching up with social media, so I'm gonna go ahead and do that. And I'll just speak to you in the morning, but it's nice to do some little skincare together. I'm gonna go ahead and put this away, not leave it here and make a mess. 
and brush my teeth and then we can watch a little bit of YouTube and head to bed. So I forgot to say, this is my little cleaning planner that I was just talking about which I haven't used in a few weeks so I really want to get back into it. But if I pan you down to like a week that I did before. So this is what I usually do. So I write kind of each kind of section of the house. So we've got a hallway which is like downstairs and then the stairs and obviously upstairs hallway. Kitchen, dressing room, bedroom, but both uh, downstairs bathroom and family bathroom, ensuite, living room and then anything else I need to do. So they're kind of like all the sections and I just write each thing that I need to do which is normally the same things for each week. It's like hoover and dust, wipe sides, clean mirrors, tidy away. That kind of thing, obviously, and like the ensuite, we like clean shower, hoover sofas, and then yeah, others like vintage uploads or anything random that I need to do, like edit a certain video or upload something. So, I'm going to go ahead and just quickly fill that out for the week and then I hopefully stay on top of things a bit more because I always forget what I've done. Okay, so I've done it for this week. So, I've got like each room is mainly just like hoover the floor, mop the floor, dust the sides, wipe the sides, tidy up clean mirrors i've got a wash load on there i've got to change the bedding um and for other at the moment i just thought, obviously want to post the shop with me but apart from that i haven't really got anything else on the agenda so obviously if anything comes up i'll put it on there but mainly content wise the stuff goes on the little to-do list so yeah but it is currently 25 past nine it is bedtime for me Good morning, happy Wednesday, happy hump day. We are halfway through the week, angels. So, you know, that's good. I mean, it's our busiest day of the week today, so we'll see how it goes. Um, I've just made my lunch because just in case my car starts going funny, I'd rather bring my lunch to work, just in case. I think I am gonna come home on my lunch break today. I think, well, obviously, just depending on the car, but so far, She's been fine, we've had no lights so far this week, so I feel like it should be fine, hopefully. <laughs> so we'll see, and like I said, I am only right like five minutes away from my work, so it's not like I'm driving far. And like if worse come to worse, like someone can come and get me. Made the same lunch, bagel, some fruit. I still haven't tried the skinny dream, so I want to try that today as my snack. Because yeah, I haven't tried that one yet. Um, I'm having the same breakfast as normal. Just blueberries, um, banana, granola, and yogurt. Sorry. Um, I'm going to try and edit a little bit of the vlog. I haven't really got long this morning. So that's one of the other reasons. I'm, where's my banana? One of the other reasons why I want to come home so that I can edit. So I can't really edit when like everyone's around. So that's kind of the plan. So hopefully all goes to plan. And I'd love to have like a little chat with you as well. Yeah, hopefully today will be a nice day. I don't know what the weather's like today. But yeah, I always want to have a little clear up tonight again. I think I'm probably going to have to stay tonight. I don't know what time till. Hopefully not too late. I'm just, I can already feel like I'm tired this week. So I'm hoping that I don't have to stay too long. I'll let you know because it's going to be the first thing I ask. Like roughly how long I'm staying. Yeah, I'm gonna eat my breakfast, try and edit a bit of this vlog, and yeah, hopefully I can get it up ready for tomorrow or tonight, depending on when it's finished. Okay, so I've just toned my face in the toilet. Toned my face. Um, it's seven o'clock, so I've literally got to leave in like a few minutes. Today, so it's gonna be cloudy and windy, but 14 degrees. I am so ready for my weather app to tell me it's sunny. I feel like I keep saying this, but I just can't wait for a bit of sun. I was saying to Tom last night, I just want to book some holiday. Like I said, I don't think we're going to go on a holiday apart from like the one in September with my parents, which I keep forgetting about actually. It's going to come around quite quick because it's already March, but I'm going to take an updated picture of the calendar at work and I'm just going to say to Tom, just let's book some time off because we've got nothing to look forward to. So, obviously, I always book our birthdays off. I think our birthdays were like a weird day this week, like a Wednesday. So, I think we'll book like Monday to Wednesday off or something. So, I might say to him, should we do that? Um, but then, yeah, apart from that, six, I'll be like, I feel I still have like six days. I don't know, I just want something to look forward to. So, I think I'm going to take a picture of it, come and show Tom. And then maybe we can just book a couple days away. I don't know. I just want something to do. Like, even if we have, like, two nights away somewhere instead of three, like, 
what we did last time was so cheap when we went to Cornwall and I loved it so I'd love to do that again do a little staycation we found so many hidden gems I would just honestly I'd just go back to that place it was so cheap it wasn't like the best site but it was in such a good area and we just loved I loved exploring Cornwall it was so fun goes to all the different beaches and things so yeah I know like we want to do the garden but like I could have told them like, we don't actually have to go out for any meals we can just cook at the caravan so if we do it like that obviously we need to do a weekly food shop anyway so we're just going to be taking the food shop and doing it in Cornwall or wherever we go so I would like to go somewhere else as well um so yeah like we're not really buying anything else we're just paying for a place to stay and it's so cheap compared to like anything else oh, God, i'm literally running so late um so yeah i'll let you know i'll talk to him tonight and we will see he was telling me though you know i said he was needing to revise for an exam the exam he's got to do i can't remember when he said it is i think it's in a few months but he's got to do it for the whole week like he's got to go up to London he works in London at the moment anyway but to a different part of London and he's got to go up there every day of the week on this week to do like this course thing and then but he's got to do it on the weekends as well because I said to him I said oh is it like just for the morning on the Saturday and Sunday because I thought oh I can go up with him and just you know go and get coffee or something and meet him after he's like finished it on the weekend and he was like no it's all day I was like really so it's like going to be this whole week where he's just in London in this course. So that's going to be fun for me. <laughs> but, oh well. I started editing the shop with me. I don't know how long it's going to be because I'm still getting... I'm still not confident enough at vlogging in public. I'm getting better. But some of the clips are just really quick. Or I'm like talking to Tom to make it look like I'm talking to Tom. <laughs> so... Yeah, but we'll see. We'll have a look. And if it's too short i mean it's fine i think the other one i did was only like 10 minutes like it wasn't very long and i think what was hard is when i did do this one a lot of the um things in the shop were very similar to the last shop with me like there was a few new bits but it was quite similar so yeah but i will i will hopefully get that up. it will either be up tonight or tomorrow so it will already be up obviously before the weekly vlog so yeah feel free to have a look what's new in um yeah i'm ready for all the spring stuff mine like i just feel like my little shops are behind i've seen so many people especially at like b&m be posting these really nice spring stuff and i feel like mine just really is lacking like it doesn't really have anything like springy at all like it has a little bit of easter but apart from that because like you know when everyone was posting or they're probably still posting but there's those mugs in B&M and they've got like strawberries or lemons like I've got the ones from last year I think it was um but they've got like a new design and they're so cute and I really want the strawberry one for um spring but yeah it's not in my store and then I've also saw someone posting these like checkered ones but they're like like pastel colors checkered which is really nice so yeah, I haven't seen those yet so I'm hoping they come in store soon so we can pick them up because they're so cute but yeah like I said I am running a bit late so I need to go um but I hope you have an amazing Wednesday or see when you're watching this if you're watching it when I post it, it'll be a Monday have a good Monday but um yeah I'm gonna go brush my teeth and then we gotta go so I just got home I decided to come home with my lunch break and I've got two parcels I've got a little one and I've also got a big one so let's have a look what's in here Tom also had a party, which I think he ordered some shirts from Vintage, but I'm not going to open that for him. He can do it himself, because I know he'll want to give me a little call like I give him. Well, oh, these are the things from Tummy Talk. So we've got some cortisol balance. These are apparently reduce stress and help balance cortisol. They do a hormonal balance. So don't they're like little... Oh, they're like little tablets. So it says to take one capsule, two... One capsule two times a day with water after a meal. And they've sent me two packs to try. So yeah, it reduces stress. I have a lot of stress and obviously anxiety. So hopefully that will help. Yeah, so we can start those. I'll probably start them tomorrow then. We've got those to try. And then yeah, I've got this huge box here. So let's see what is inside. Oh, okay. Oh my God. No way. 
This is the Mark Hill Jordan Lipscone range. I love the Mark Hill curler. Hold on, let me just send this to Tom. Um, love the Mark Hill Pick and Mix um, curler. I don't always use it. Um, and this is the basically the same one, but with the Jordan Lipscone range. So it comes with this little bag. Yeah, Mark Hill is such a good curler. Oh, how good is this? It's like, this is what I've needed to travel. So when I travel, I always take my curlers and I've never got anything to put them in. So it's like a little travel kit. Um... I can't believe I got sent this. So we've got the, this is the Jordan Lipscomb edition curling one handle. Let's open it and have a little look. What's this scissors gone? Oh my god, I can't believe that. That's so exciting. Because I could always give my mum the other handle. Because um, obviously you don't need two handles and then she can have one because it's so good. So this is what she, it looks like it's a really nice grey colour because my other one's quite bright. So I could always keep this handle and she could have my old handle. So I might FaceTime her quickly because she obviously doesn't work all the time. But I'll see if she's free to FaceTime. Let me shove that back in there. Then we can see what um, handles they've given. So we've got a little heat, heating glove thing. And then so what have we got here? We've got the Mermaid Waver which is one of my favourites. We've got the round brush, which I've never tried, but this could be really good for getting those, like, that blow-dry look. And we've also got the medium barrel, which is always a good one to have. I can't believe that. Thank you so much. That's with Community Scene, which is one of my little companies that sort me out with a lot of PR and things. Oh, I'm so feeling so grateful about that. That's so exciting. So I'm going to face my mum. I'm going to eat my lunch. I need to edit the rest of the video. So maybe we can try that over the weekend. Um... But that's super exciting. I'm going to take a picture of that. Yeah, I'm going to eat my lunch and face my mum. It's 20 past one. I've edited the video. I've downloaded it onto my laptop. So it's ready to go up. So depending what time I'm home, I'll either get it up tonight or tomorrow. Um, depending on when I'm home. So that's kind of the plan. Because I will, would take it to work to meet with... Oh my god, I can't talk. I would take it to work and try and download it. But it literally took... It didn't download anything at all when I went last time. And it was on all day. So yeah but i've just brushed my hair give myself a little spritz but yeah it's nearly half one so that's why i need to be back so i'm gonna go ahead back to work um i don't know what time i'm gonna be at work till probably about the same time as yesterday so about half five i think we're gonna have a shepherd's pie tonight so that'll be nice i don't actually think we've had one here i don't think we've made one like, i haven't made a shepherd's pie for so long so hopefully it turns out okay i don't know if i've got everything for it i think i do We'll find out later, won't we? But yeah, I'm going to go head back to work and then we can have a nice little wholesome dinner tonight. Um, yeah. Good evening. It's 10 to 6. I finished at half five and I put myself up for Starbucks. I picked up the iced strawberry matcha tea latte. He like knows who I am now. I feel like I've been every week, which isn't very good, but I just needed it, especially just after all the stress at the moment. I need to face my mum, so I didn't end up getting hold of her earlier. So I'm going to try again to face on her. And I really need to clean the shower, like the ensuite shower. So I'm going to go ahead and do that now because I'm not going to do it. I haven't done it for over a week and it needs to be done. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. I won't show you because it's absolutely filthy. But yeah, that's kind of my plan for now. I'm eight stars away from getting a reward, which is so annoying. Like That's like the smallest amount ever. So I should get one after the next one. Where is my mum? She's at home. I'm going to face some her quickly before she does anything. And then I'll talk to you after I've cleaned the shower. And it's all sparkly. So it's 8 o'clock. And we actually ended up going for a tack about tonight. Because why not? We're going to play. Oh, I always get the seven layer burrito. Which is like the vegetarian one. I just love it. It's got like beans in it. Sour cream. Salsa. Puppy milk. And then I got some cheesy fries. I think, because did you did you take the sour cream with the chips? Yeah. Yeah. Um, so I kept sour cream because I love sour cream. So we've got sour cream and cheese on chips. And then, yeah, I got the seven layer burrito. And then I think Tom got like some box thing that came with churros. Is there more than one? Hmm? More than one churro? Mm, yeah. Uh, so, yeah, there is. So we're going to have those afterwards. We're watching Virgin River and we're going to go and eat. Dinner is served. Yum, yum, yum. Good evening. It's currently 20 to 10. I've just had a quick shower and 
tone my face obviously going to do the rest of my skincare um i've also just gone ahead uploaded the shop with me i've well i've scheduled it for tomorrow at six o'clock so obviously that'll be up before the weekly vlog so hopefully you enjoyed it it's quite short it's only 10 minutes i need to get better at like vlogging in public and do like some more i don't know just better vlogs but i'm sure with time like obviously i'll get more confident but i'm still you know fairly new in my eyes like i'm not very big or anything like that so i'm sure over time we'll get more confident um and do you know what i think i'm actually more confident when i'm on my own compared to when i'm with tom don't know why but yeah hope you enjoyed it anyway just seeing like what was new in, in the shops but yeah we watched a bit of virgin river we're nearly on season four already and there's only five seasons i'm literally obsessed if you haven't watched you need to like i don't know how we didn't watch it sooner like i just didn't think it'd be something tom is into but he's loving it too it's just one of those easy watching like programs that you just constantly want to binge like you don't want to be you're not like oh I really want to go to bed now like I'm bored like every episode is good and I'm just obsessed with the characters and yeah like I don't really want to say much because like, I don't want to spoil anything like I don't know if anything do you know what I mean I just don't want to spoil anything so if you haven't watched get to know um what else was I going to say I really want to get back into my evening teas I can't be bothered to or should I make one tonight basically i've just been feeling very like bloated and obviously i was on my period the last few days but obviously it's kind of gone now i'm just feeling after like every meal just very bloated and just like puffy i don't know how to explain it um and when we first moved in we were very much into our tea that like you would have seen in vlogs before we were having like evening teas every night like i mean like a fruit tea um, and we've got different ones for like sleep, digestion and things like that so I might ask him if he wants one and I might go ahead and make myself one quickly and go see what ones are downstairs because I feel like it used to help and obviously they're so good for you as well so yeah I might go quickly check what's there before I brush my teeth because I think we've still got quite a lot but yeah so that's what I'm going to do now I've done my skincare, just need to brush my hair video is done so I just need to obviously do the thumbnail and things like that it's Thursday tomorrow. We are getting there, guys. Slowly. I think I think I said this already, but tomorrow should, unless anything goes wrong, <laughs> I should be doing my usual shift. Though in my head, I feel like I can't. Now I'm thinking about it. I feel like I was told I can, but now I'm thinking that I can't because two other people are off. I'm gonna have to double check that, guys. I could be wrong there. <laughs> um. So yeah, oh, yeah. Let's go and see what tea do I want one tonight. <laughs> I don't even know if I can bother to go back downstairs, but I feel like it could really help my bloating. Maybe we should. I'll see if Tom wants one, and then maybe that make my decision for me. Good morning. It's Thursday. Happy Thursday, angels. It's twenty to seven. I've just made my breakfast. I'm gonna come home on my lunch break again. So I'm not gonna bother making my lunch today no my luck i'm gonna get something wrong with my car now but well i've been forget forgetting to take my vitamins so i need to get back into those so i've got my vitamin d3 here and obviously i need to take the beauty tablets so i'm gonna get make myself some apple juice so i can take those because i can't take those without water apple juice i've been loving having the juice we used to do it all the time in our weekly food shop get a juice but we had it for a while and i've had juice the last two times because i've needed it for like one of the dinners so it's been really nice. But I just love having it in the morning. It's so refreshing. Yeah, it's Thursday. I don't know if I'm going to have to stay because I was told I don't have to, but I was looking at the people and I think I, I think I said this last night. I think I might have to. So I'll keep you updated on that one because, yeah, I'm very tired to get to that point. But if I don't, if I finish early, I want to do a big clean up around the house so you can come with me just to kind of go around and tidy every room just so we can start cleaning and that's why that's on a thursday normally is just get pick up everything so friday i can do all the cleaning so that's what i want to do this evening hopefully if i am back late i'll still probably do a little bit because i don't want to leave it all for the weekend so i think that's kind of the plan um so yeah, so i cleaned the shower yesterday which is the thing i hate doing the most so that's made me really happy i love making it look sparkly i'm just trying to remember and tell tom as well to squeegee the shower every time we have a shower we used to be really good at it we've fallen out of habit i've got back into it but i don't think he has so 
need to get him back into that. I need to eat my breakfast and then we can do our skin. It's just turned seven o'clock, so I literally need to leave in a minute. What are we thinking of my hair? I've kind of got used to it now. Obviously, it's still shorter, but you can tell like how much thicker it is. I, because we got the new curling stuff yesterday, I'm thinking this weekend we can do like a little curling hair situation because I like I said before I've already got that Mark Hill thing so it's just a different colour and there's some different ones in there so I thought we could try that together this weekend and have it nice and curled because I really liked how it looked when my mum did it quite quickly the other day so yeah I think we could do that with this lip balm on um that uh, yeah, I sort of don't have plans for the weekend, but I want to do something interesting because I feel like the vlogs are getting very samey, very repetitive because my life is just boring, <laughs> if I'm honest. I just want to, I don't know, what is the web? Did we look at the weather? I can't remember. I don't know if we had this conversation the other day. I literally forget. Oh, it says, it's cloudy this weekend, but Sunday's actually meant to be 17 degrees. That's like the warmest day on my weather. So maybe we could do something like go to a beach or... So that I'll talk to Tom and see. I feel like I did say this the other day, so and I forgot to talk to him about it. So I think we could, or even just a day out somewhere else in like a little village. We've got a few villages nearby, so maybe I'll talk to him about that. Cause that'd be so nice to do something a little bit different. Um, yeah, I wanted to do some interesting things in the vlogs. Hopefully, as it gets more into summer, we'll be doing more interesting things in the evenings, and that it's lighter in the evening. So I just feel like we can do a lot more. So it'll be so interesting. But I can't believe it's already halfway through March. It's actually crazy. Like it's nearly April. But um, I need to remember to take a picture of the calendar at work today. Because I need to book some time off. Like I've got nothing to look forward to till September. Which is too long. So let's book some time off. I'm going to go ahead and look today. I'm going to come back to you. And I'm going to have plans. <laughs> Hello my loves. It is currently half one. I've been home on my lunch break. I had some calls to do. And I'm just kind of clearing up. I've just tidied the sides. Hoovered. The kitchen I'm going to hoover the living room quickly just kind of like catch up on a few cleaning bits um but I need to go back in about five minutes I am staying tonight I think we're probably going to be there till like I don't know half five probably again um so yeah we'll probably be there till about half five again tomorrow I will be doing my usual shift so I'm excited for that yeah just going to finish clearing up while I've got five minutes just to hoover the living room quickly Okay, so I have hoover the living room, hoover the kitchen, clean, cleared the side, cleared the side, and you just need to put these grates back in the fridge. Um, I'm feeling good and feeling productive. Glad I got a few things done. Hopefully, we can get a couple little bits done later. Like I said, I'll mainly probably do it tomorrow because I'm actually finishing on time for once. But yeah, I'm trying to get a few things. I wanted to like clean the French doors and things like that. Um, what was I going to say? Let's talk about what we're grateful for. We're trying to stay positive after feeling overtired and stressed. So what are we grateful for? I'm grateful for having a job. I am grateful for having my own house with my amazing boyfriend. I'm grateful for Tom. He is amazing. He loves me. He makes me so happy. Um, I'm grateful for earning money and being able to afford the things that I want to afford. I am grateful for having a car and being able to travel where I need to go. I'm grateful for my mum and everything she's done for me. I'm grateful for my health, feeling well. Haven't been ill for a while, so I'm grateful for my health. I'm grateful for my skin and my eyelashes. I'm grateful that my skin is looking good. I'm grateful that my body is able to move the way I want it to. And yeah, just trying to feel grateful even in like stressful situations. But I do need to head back to work. So yeah, have a little think what you're grateful for. Take 10, min 10 minutes to say what you're grateful for, think about it in your head, say it on the way to work, write it in your notes, just saying you're grateful just puts a little benefit into your day. But let's go to work. Good evening, my lovelies. It's 5.30, I've just got home. It's honestly just started tipping it down and I'm so cold. I've just got two parcels. This one is my pill, so nothing exciting. But let's see what is in this parcel. They dropped it out my name again. I always feel bad, I'm like, I'm so sorry about like, all the time. Um, but they don't seem to mind. Um, I'm so cold from the rain. I think I'm going to make myself a hot drink. Hold on, Tom's cold day. Hello. Hello. Yeah, you. Okay, Tom was just letting me know he's on his way home. So we've got the, this says, it's from Arcane Communications, which is another PR company I work with. This is the Derma Roller Deep Cleanser. So it says, Deep Cleanser Intensive Skin Cleanser Accelerus Pro. Let's see what she looks like. 
very big, I feel like she's going to last a long time. So you create a foam in your hands with a small amount to cleanse the skin and then rinse the skin with warm water. So another cleanser to try, maybe we can test her out this week, see what she's like. Um, dinner wise, we get, I don't know if I've said this already, so I just keep repeating myself, I think I keep forgetting what I've told you and what I haven't told you. We're going to have a shepherd's pie tonight, I think. Um, so I can't remember how long that takes in the oven, I feel like it's quite a while, so I just need to find what recipe I'm going to do. And then we can make that tonight together. I'm just going to chill for a little bit, I do need to tidy, but honestly I'm so tired. But I think I will do some tidying. Um in a little bit i just want to sit down let myself rest I'm gonna make myself a little coffee i think so let's make myself maybe like a little caramel coffee <laughs> tea in my cup of tea cup of coffee in my favorite mug this is the cup of positivity i got this from b&m a while ago and it's so cute you know i love a mug like my, if you were to buy me a mug like every year i'd be so happy like it's literally my favorite thing let me just put this milk back plans this weekend and next week let's kind of talk things over um <clears throat> so i said i think in the last week's vlog i don't know if i've mentioned it in this one i want to get my ears pissed and I've wanted to for a while, I've been very 50-50, but you know what, I think I'm just going to do it. I've always wanted to have earrings in, I think they look so cute, like with your hair up and like changing them up for different outfits and things. So I think I might look with Tom tonight and we'll book it for this weekend. So we can go get that done together, I'll try and get Tom to get a little clip and we get them done. I might be like, I'm not very good at pain, so I'm a bit scared, but I'm sure it'll be fine. I think they're going to look so cute. Also, I think I said before, I want to get back into routine and I feel like I haven't been able to this week because my shifts have been different so I haven't really been in a routine but just want to get in a routine with gym, healthy eating, vitamins and cleaning back on top of it. So um, I want to do kind of a workout at least three times a week and once on the weekend. It's been I was going to do something today but I, again I'm just knackered. I need to give myself, let myself rest and I'll start again. I might do something on the weekend. So I want to make sure we do a big walk, at least one big walk every weekend. And then I'm thinking I'll either do like a little workout session downstairs either like a YouTube workout or I've got some dumbbells, I quite like, but you know, better than nothing, or a run on the week, depending on the weather. And then three times during the week, I want to do either a YouTube workout, Pilates or something, um, or go on a run, and just so I'm moving my body. And I think eventually I'm going to look into classes, and I think eventually I'll get back into the gym. I do want to go back, but I think for now, as long as I'm moving my body, I'm going to feel good because at the moment I just feel very like groggy and I just don't feel myself. I used to be such a gym girl and a healthy eater. Like I still, I'm not too bad, but yeah, especially lunches I need to get back on top of. I think maybe next week we'll have some salads again because I think when I start to have sandwiches or bagels, I start to snack more. So I think I'm going to have some salads again next week. So we can make that together. I might just have tuna or I might just get some ham. It's probably the easiest ham and cheese little salad. So I might start doing that. Um, and then cleaning schedule. I want to make sure I'm doing at least 20 minutes each night. And I think when it comes to Wednesday or Thursday, I think I'm going to set myself a timer. I've seen a lot of people doing it on TikTok. It's really inspired me. Set myself a timer for an hour and see how much tidying slash cleaning I can get done. And yeah, I just feel better for myself. Um, but yeah, I think if I do at least 20 minutes each day, it's going to really put me on top of things. But um, I don't think anyone's off next week. So I'm thinking of booking off Tuesday. Tom said he might be having a half day, so I'm going to see if he can get it off as well, or at least a half day, and maybe we can do something together, but if not, I just want a day to chill, if I'm honest, so I think I'm thinking of booking that off. I've taken a picture of the calendar, so me and Tom can kind of have a look through it together. Okay, I'm going to sit on the sofa, watch some YouTube, drink my coffee. I haven't had a hot coffee in so long. So nice. I just felt really cold when I came in, because it was absolutely, you know when it's like raining and windy, you're literally like in a storm? <laughs> that's how I felt but yeah I'm gonna find my little shepherd's pie recipe and then we can make that in like an hour so I was sitting down the royal mail turned up package heaven this week I'm feeling so grateful thank you so much to all the brands thank you to you guys and just 
just thank you. I'm feeling so grateful for all the opportunities and I wouldn't have any of it without you guys on my social media platform. So I'm feeling so grateful. I feel like we've had quite a few this week. We've got quite a few new things to test out. So what have we got here? This is a Revolution 2-in-1 Peptide Serum. It's a lash and brow serum to naturally enhance your lashes and condition and strengthen your brows. Obviously, I already used the Glow For It serum, but maybe we could use this as well. And we could also try it on our brows to try and make them look a bit better. So it says, 84% agree brows appear thicker after eight weeks. So maybe we can try this out on our brows. Thank you very much. That's from Revolution. Thank you for Revolution. A shepherd's pie time, but I just got an email saying something had been delivered, and I was like, it definitely hasn't. And I was like, I bet the postman's left it outside and not told me. Yes, he has. So it's dripping wet. But this is from a brand called Hiccup. Which I've, oh my God, just dripping everywhere. I've never really um, heard of before, but they reached out to me and said they wanted to send me some bits. So I got to choose a few items. So I thought I'd give you a little mini haul. So there's not really enough for like a proper haul. So I thought I can give you a little mini haul in here. At some point we can try them on. So we can't actually remember what I got. But I remember there was like some cute bits. So we'll see what the quality is like. So for starters, I got this knitted jumper. There was a few colours, but I thought I don't actually have like a blue one, so I thought this was really cute. The quality feels really nice and soft, really thick. Um, I got this in a size small, I think. I oh, know, I got it in a 12 to 14. So it's like, I think it's meant to be cropped, but I got it a bit bigger, so it's not like super cropped. The colour's really nice and the material feels really, really good. So that's the first thing. Then, everything is just a of wet. It's very, it annoys me when they don't tell me like it's outside. Then I got this really cute pie and I got this because I thought this was super cute and I also thought this is going to look so cute for an Instagram post. So I need to see if me and Tom can shoot some content this weekend. How cute is this? It's a little cardigan. I got this in a size, I think, medium as well. But it's got little strawberries on. I thought it was so cute. Again, it's such thick material, super soft. I'm really impressed with the material, but I thought that's going to look so cute, it's going to be nice to lounge in, and like I said, it's going to be such a cute little Instagram post, isn't it? I think there's only there one more, or maybe two more things, what's this? Oh, I have so many, I've got so many things to do this weekend, so I need to write myself a little to-do list of everything I need to do. Okay, then I got this little top, which I thought was really cute, it's black and white, I think this would look really cute with jeans, or like with a little black skirt. Again, material, really, really thick. The material is amazing, and I've never heard, the. this is what the brand is called, by the way, literally Hiccup. So, that's really cute. And then I think there's just one more item. Oh yeah, I remember these. These are like some little trousers, and I thought these would be really, really cute. So they're grey, they're like baggy at the bottom. I thought these were really, really cute. They look really comfy, and I feel like you could like dress them up, dress them down. Um, I feel like they're going to be a really nice staple for like all seasons. So I'm really excited to try them on. I think that's everything. Yes, that is everything in the package. So thank you to Hiccup. Um, I need to tell Tom we need to do a content this weekend. I'm so behind on content anyway, so I need to do one anyway. At least we've got some new bits to shoot, so that's really exciting. But he's about 40 minutes away, so I need to start the shepherd's pie, because obviously it takes a while to cook. So, I'll try and bring you along with me.
what Christmas is all about. Might please? So the shepherd's pie is made, Tom's just making some gravy. It actually turned out quite nice though, so hopefully it tastes right. I did have a little taste test and I think it's okay. Okay, so it's 10 to 10 and we are heading to bed. I've just wrote down all the content um, that I need to do this week. Oh, I've just seen something else I haven't done. But I'm just so behind on everything. Where I sometimes do things after work and haven't been able to, I'm so behind. I feel like my is going on i feel like some of the lighting on my camera this week has been really weird um yeah where i normally sometimes do things after work and haven't been able to i'm really behind on like content like i've got i think like 12 things to film this weekend but obviously i'm meant to be finishing early tomorrow so i might try and get a little bit done tomorrow like i need the skincare bit because obviously skincare i don't need to do my hair or my makeup it's just trying out products or like testing them out or creating UGC content with them. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that tomorrow. So I can do hopefully one, I could probably do one of those, two, three, I could probably do like three, no, four and a half of them. So I can do like half of one kind of, yeah. I'm not gonna tell you what it is. Yeah, I've got a few things to do tomorrow. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and do them. And then obviously I've got the new clothes that I got today and the makeup. I have just put the cardigan on because I just realized I was like in just a bralette and I was like, can't just do that because I'll just throw this on because it was next to me. And it is actually so soft and cozy. And I think it's gonna be so cute for a little pic. I did say to Tom, we need to shoot some content this weekend because I'm so behind and yeah, just need to get a bunch of stuff done for that. Oh, I left my, I found my Laneige lip mask, it was downstairs and I've left it downstairs. Um, it's Friday tomorrow, so feeling really good that we're finding at the end of the week. We've also just booked some time off, so I'm really excited. We've got some time off in May, in June, and obviously we're already off in September for our holiday. And then we've also booked some time off for my birthday, so We've got some things to look forward to. We haven't actually, like, we're not, haven't booked anything for those days, but obviously we, I just had a holiday to use and I thought just in case we want to book something, then we've got time off. And if not, like, we can do like some little days out and things. So that's kind of the plan. But it's just nice to have some things a bit closer to look forward to because otherwise I was literally just looking at the calendar like we've got nothing to look forward to till September. So it's nice to have something. My hair's looking super shiny. But yeah, it's 10 to 10, I'm tired, we're finally at the end of the week, and I'm doing my normal shift tomorrow, so I'm feeling good that I'm actually going to, that we're doing overtime, so hopefully we can get a few things done tomorrow evening, because the house is just a little bit of a mess, because I haven't been able to keep on top of it with the overtime. But yeah, I'm going to head to bed, and I'll speak to you in the morning, I don't know what is going on with the lighting, but I just look very like, I don't know what the word is, not there. Good morning, it's Friday Angels, so I'm feeling really good and as you know, I'm doing my actual shift today, so do you know what, I feel like the day actually might go quite quick because I'm not doing like that extra just over an hour, like it's going to make such a difference. I'm going to take my vitamins, so I've got my vitamin D3, just drop one on the floor, and then I'm going to take the Equi London, I keep forgetting about these, I like, okay with them in the morning and forget during the day so I need to remember. So I'm going to take two of these and then obviously we've got these tummy tox cortisol balances which reduce stress and help balance cortisol. What is cortisol? I can't remember what that is. Is that something to do with like stress and anxiety? Cortisol is a steroid hormone and a stress hormone when used as a medication. Oh, so it says high levels of cortisol can make you fatigued, irritable, headaches, inter intestinal problems, anxiety or depression, weight gain, blood pressure, low libido. I actually have quite a few of those, so maybe maybe this will help because I'm always stressed and then I'm probably getting some of these factors. So what does it say? Take one capsule two times a day, so you need to take one of them. Let's see what they look like quite big again. Yeah. I'm going to have it with my apple juice. We will see 
what happens. I need to do a post for them on the weekend. So, yeah, we'll see what happens. And then I'm just going to take these. Yeah, it's finally Friday. So, my plan is, on my lunch break, I think I'm going to edit a bit of the weekly vlog. Because I've just realised I haven't edited any of it. So, I'm just going to spend my lunch break editing the weekly vlog. And then after work, I'm just going to literally go around the whole house and tidy up anything that's on the floor and put a wash load on so yeah we will bring you along just tidying up every single thing that's on the floor putting it in the place it needs to be see what the time is and then I'll probably do some cleaning because Tom normally cooks today so I've got a bit more time so I'll probably go around I might don't go upstairs and clean everything upstairs first because I obviously you end up going over the kitchen every day anyway so I don't mind doing that on the weekend but if I just get upstairs all done then that's done for the weekend so I might hoover up there and then just get some bits done yeah, I think I'm going to edit the weekly vlog on my lunch break, but I do need to go do my skincare, so I will meet you upstairs and we can continue this chat, but I just need to take these. It's just about to turn 7 o'clock. I feel like the lighting in some of like my clips this week have been really weird. I don't know if I've done something, I don't know. But I'm just putting my SPF on, I've done the rest of my skincare, I just need to brush my teeth, put some perfume on. Um, but yeah, I'm really excited to just go around the house and tidy, because I just it's been annoying me is that the stage where it's annoying me because i would have normally i don't know done a few bits by now i just haven't been able to because i've just been so tired i've just told myself like you need to let yourself rest after all this overtime but i want to have a nice fun weekend like i said i still don't know what we're doing but i'm just gonna say tom let's do something fun let's do something different just go go somewhere and do something just to kind of reward myself for all this hard work and um, because of that obviously because I want to be busy and doing things with Tom I don't want to be spending the weekend cleaning so that's why I just want to get everything done because it feels so good when you wake up or when you come home and the house is tidy I mean to be fair the downstairs isn't that bad I've been like kind of half keeping up on top of it when I can it's just upstairs but it always is like that so it's fine I'm just going to quickly do that when I get home make it all super tidy my lashes are looking long again which is good but yeah hopefully these little stress tablets work because i am always stressed and i always have anxiety and i feel like maybe this whole cortisol thing it was talking about could be the reason why but who knows we'll find out won't we if it works but obviously i'll keep you updated i'll keep you updated and we will see see what happens i guess but i'm excited to just clean the house with you we can do a little cleaning montage and yeah but i'm gonna head to work i need to remember to bring my laptop with me just in case i can get some work done and yeah i'll speak to you in a couple of hours i've just been home on my lunch break and um the only reason i'm only talking to you now is just because i spent my lunch break um I spent my lunch break doing editing for my weekly vlog, this vlog. So I realised I hadn't edited yet because I haven't been home in the afternoon. Um, so I'm just leaving my house now, going back to work. So I thought I'd just say good afternoon, I hope you're okay. I ate my lunch um, and yeah, I've literally just done some editing. I opened an Oasis. Yeah, I thought we could talk plans this evening. So I'm finishing on time, thank God. So finishing at quarter past four, so I should be home by half four latest. Um, so yeah, my plan is I'm going to come straight home. I do kind of want to do a workout, so I could potentially do one as soon as I get in. Obviously, I might go on a walk tonight, um, and then I'm going to literally go around the whole house. I'll try and take you with me. We can do a little kind of cleaning montage. I'm going to go around the whole house, mainly upstairs. Um, and I'm gonna kind of pick up all the toy, all the toys, oh god, it's because I'm at work. Um, I'm gonna pick up all the clutter, all the mess of upstairs and like, yeah, I'm gonna start upstairs and once I've gone around the whole house, picking up everything, putting it back where it belongs and I'm gonna t clean upstairs because that needs to be done. Um, I need to clean downstairs as well, but like I said earlier, like I can do that on the weekend if need be. So I'm gonna mainly focus on upstairs, but I just want everywhere to be tidy. Like I hate walking in my house, like in a room, and it being a mess, like it really stresses me out. It's like what people say, isn't it? Like tidy, 
tidy space, tidy mind or whatever it is. And my mind is not tidy. It's so like, I'm just like, in my head, I'm like, I've got to do this, I've got to do this, I've got to do this. Sorry, the lighting's really bad. Um, so yeah, I just want to get everything tidy, ready for tonight. I don't know what we're going to have for dinner. It is Tom's day of cooking. There's two meal ideas. There's either a salmon, like red Thai curry, or there's a chili con carne. So I'll see which one he would rather make. Um, and yeah, so we're gonna have one of those tonight, one of them tomorrow. We're gonna watch some Virgin River. We're loving it. We're on season three, I think. Season three or season four? Season three, I think. Loving it. Though the last episode just annoyed me. Obviously not gonna tell you, because if you haven't watched it, then you don't know. But yeah, just not happy with something that just happened. <laughs> But yeah, I'm like two minutes away from work, so I will speak to you when I'm home and we can, yeah, just sort my life out. <laughs> See, I did a little mini cleaning montage. I haven't shown you everything because my tripod, there's something wrong with it, and it's just not folding up properly and like moving, so it's really hard to get it in some locations. I've just cleaned oh my god. I just cleaned my sink so it was looking so dirty. I love how nice it looks when it's like clean because it gets stained so easy because it's like matte and white. Um so yeah, I'm glad I've just cleaned that. I've made myself some collagen squash. Tom is on his way home, I'm watching some YouTube. I think Tom's probably about half an hour. He said he'd be home by seven. Yeah, he's about half an hour away, so he's gonna make dinner tonight. We're either having a chili con carne or a salmon red Thai curry. I've sent him both the recipes and he can choose which one he'd rather do. And um, then we'll do the other one tomorrow. But I've put a wash load on, I've cleared upstairs. I've just put the hoover on charge and then we're gonna go ahead and hoover upstairs in a minute. I just wanna finish emptying the dishwasher refill the dishwasher, put anything in the bin and then we'll go hoover upstairs and then we will chill. So that is kind of my plan for now. I'm just so glad it's Friday. Oh, I need to put my ear piercing in. I need to do that tonight. Because, yeah, I think I'll put my... I might as well just pick it for tomorrow, maybe, or Sunday. I don't know. But I definitely want to get them done. Let's do it. It's going to be so much fun. You guys can come along with me. Okay. 
I pooed upstairs. I didn't show you because I forgot, if I'm honest. Um, but I've just made myself a little matcha using the Alpro vanilla milk as always. So that's super yum. I'm going to just let myself chill now. The house is pretty tidy. We're getting there. Obviously, like I said, I need to reset the kitchen tonight anyway. So I've done most of it, but well, there's no point doing it all anyway because Tom's cooking. So I'm going to have to clean and make it look just how it was anyway. So let's go and chill for a little bit because he's nearly home. Good evening. It's almost 11 o'clock at night. I can't lie. We, I have got a towel on by the way. I've just had a shower. Um, we are on season four of Virgin River and the last few, we watched about three or four episodes tonight and the last few episodes have been drama packed. It's been so good. I haven't wanted to like turn it off and I've just been like, oh, I've cried nearly. I've been in shock. Honestly, if you haven't watched it, I recommend I just wish we watched it sooner. I'm obsessed. But we're already on season four. And there's only five seasons. But I think, like I said before, they're bringing out another season. Fingers crossed, because I just don't want it to end. It's so good. So, yeah, definitely recommend. Um, we had a chili con carne. We just had, like, chili con carne with tortilla chips. And we just dipped it in and ate that. I ate some more of my Easter egg. But I need to get back into my fitness and my healthy eating this weekend. Um, so, I think I might do a little workout in the morning. And then obviously go on a walk. I need to do a bunch of content this week. I've got so much content to do. It's literally all sitting in front of me. I've had a few changes in my dressing room. But I'll show you in the morning. Because I'm in my town. And it's just not vibe. So <laughs> I'll show you in the morning. I've just changed a few things. Just to make my life easier. I think it looks quite nice. It's not like dramatic change. Just a few little things. So I'll show you that in the morning. But yeah I've got so much content to do. We've got skincare. We've got makeup. We've got clothes. We've got Instagram content um so i think we'll probably do the instagram stuff tomorrow and if i've got any like morning skincare and obviously makeup i'll do that tomorrow as well and then we could do the evening skincare tomorrow and then whatever's left i'll probably get ready again on sunday and do some like get ready with me's and stuff it's just always good to have extra content for tiktok and instagram like using get ready with me so that's kind of my plan for this weekend so a lot of content i need to get back into my reading girl era i've just kind of fallen off the bandwagon like i don't know what's happen like I think I'm just not prioritizing it like I know I want to do it but I'm not prioritizing the reading and I need to so um I'm going to bring my book to the bedroom now and read a few pages and then I might wake up early and read some more in the morning hopefully I remember what's been going on obviously I'm reading a quarter mist and fury so yeah but I'm gonna head to bed and I'll speak to you in the morning because I'm gonna be absolutely shattered good morning the sun is shining today it's currently 20 past nine happy Saturday um, the weather is so lovely today. It's sunny and cloudy and cloudy all day, but we've got blue skies and it's so nice. So I want to make the most of it and go on a walk, but I do need to do a little bit of content. I've got a few products to film. Um, I've got the little lip balm. I've got the Max Factor Eye Enhancer, which I use with you guys already. I want to test out this made by Mitchell Blush in Can't Cope With Coral and the Magnet Mascara from Benefit. So I'll try and remember to video when I'm using these two because you haven't seen them before but you've seen these two so I need to film those and then I just need to do an unboxing of the latest in beauty um the second box I got for tiktok and I've got a really sore throat this morning it's really hurting um I also want to film a couple get ready with me so I'm going to do a couple with the new hiccup stuff that I got um and see what the time is and then I might just do another one just so I've got a few different pieces of content and I'll do them for Instagram as well. So I do obviously do some talking clips, some not talking. So I could do it for both platforms. Um, I think I'm going to shoot some content tomorrow. But yeah, I just want to make the most of the weather. So I want to go on a walk. So I just want to get ready. And then we can go out for a nice little stroll. I don't know if we're going to grab a little sandwich. There's this little um, kind of sandwich shop near us. Which is so nice. We've only been there once. But it was so good. And we haven't been back again. Um, so potentially we might grab that. But yeah. My throat's really hurt, so it's really annoying, but I'm just gonna get ready and then I'll try and remember to show you these things too. So I'm in the middle of doing my makeup and I got a new made by Mitchell Blush to try, which I haven't tried this one yet. This is the Can't Cope with Coral. I thought we could try it out together. So I've done like my base and my like contour. I thought let's try this out. I just always put a little couple dots on the cheeks. It's like a really nice peachy colour. I feel like it's gonna be perfect for like spring and summer. And I always just blend it with my fingers. And I feel like just made by Mitchell blushes are so, they're so pigmented and they always look so pretty. And I feel like this one's just going to be super pretty for those summer months coming up. Look how cute that is, I hope you can see it. If I come a bit closer. 
so pretty okay so i've just curled my lashes and we've got a new mascara to try i love trying new mascaras and this one really intrigued me this is the benefit their real magnet mascara so it says 40 percent longer powerful lift and extend a brush with magnetically charged core pulls the magnetic mineral and and up and out beyond the tips of your lashes so apparently there's like a magnet that helps make your lashes as long as they can be this is the packaging I'm really intrigued. I don't understand. I'm a bit scared. Like, what does it mean? Because it says here, mascara with a magnetic force that draws lashes out to extreme lengths. Obviously, my lashes are quite long anyway. But let's see. I do love a Benefit mascara. That is the one I usually go for. I always go for Benefit. I feel like they're the best. apply a few layers this is how we're looking they are looking very long to be fair let me go ahead and do the other one so this is how one eyelash is looking i feel like benefit mascaras are the best like i'd always go back and buy them like whenever i'm like reaching for a mascara it's always benefit i don't need anything else and i don't think i've like come across one from them that i don't like A little dip. This is how we're looking. I feel like my makeup's turning quite nicely today. Okay, so this is the finished result with the mascara. I feel like it looks really good if I look up. They look super long, super lengthening. And as always, I just love a Benefit mascara. They are the best. Super long. So I'm just going to spray myself with setting spray and i'm going to film a couple get ready with me's if i try anything new on i'll show you what they look like but i just want to get them done it's only 10 to 10 so i just want to get them done and then we can go on a nice little stroll so i'm currently filming some get ready with me my makeup looks really good in the camera but i have had some mascara under my eyes why does that always happen i forgot to show you my first outfit so i'll insert it in on here the little tiktok um but i wore ow. I wore this little black and white, to put you up here, I wore this little, this is from Hiccup, this little black and white crop, which I showed you yesterday I think, along with the grey trousers and some little Uggs. How cute is this jumper? I think I'm going to wear this today, not this outfit because it's not warm enough. This jumper is also from Hiccup. Like I was saying when I got, sorry my breath from moving. <laughs> The quality is amazing. I've never heard of this brand and I actually want to order my like just stuff of it anyway. It's so thick, so soft. This colour is so nice. I don't have anything this colour in my wardrobe. And I've paired it with these linen trousers from Primark and I'm going to put on some little Uggs. Um, I'm just planning content for Instagram and obviously filming to get ready with me. So I thought I'd show you because it's so cute and I think I'm definitely going to wear this today. Maybe with some leggings or something. Um, but I'm obsessed, so cute. I also, excuse me, in the background... I just got sent this from like a TikTok brand. So I think it's like for skincare. So you should try and take this top bit off. Yeah, the postman knocked on the door and I think he was annoyed at me. And you see, where I do social media, I get a lot of parcels and like normally on a Saturday he gets excited because so like I'm actually going to open the door. And I didn't because he said he rang the doorbell but it didn't come through so I don't know why. Um, so yeah, but basically is this so you've got this upper bit here which is quite big and you put loads of skincare and then you've got two extra little drawers to put things in but I just don't really know like where to put it because I'm debating whether to just put my perfumes in there because I've got so many and that will just get rid of the ugly heart thing so I might try that because that's like what's on the side so I might see if they fit quickly. So <clears throat> this is how it's looking at the moment. I need to still fiddle about with the others, but I think I'll just do that later. But I think it does look better, so we'll play around with it a bit later. I thought to show you as well. I put the little thing that was in the bathroom in here, and I think it's just a lot better for storage. So I've got kind of like my notebooks, and I'm putting my current read on the top. <clears throat> my deodorants. Excuse that the whole thing isn't there, it's because I need to get some top ups. Pencils, and then down here we've got like all my hair tools, and it just fits perfectly in that little gap because this is where my mirror normally is. So, 
yeah we're getting there it still looks a bit cluttered i just need to just organize it a bit better okay so there's like this sandwich shop but it's like a bakery near us and um three days of the week no yeah three days of the week they do a beef brisket sandwich and three days a week they do a pulled pork and today's the beef brisket one so tom's gone in to go and get it i just feel really dodgy all of a sudden i feel really sick so I just said I'm going to sit in the car, but there is a queue outside, like the queue is so long because it opens at half eleven, it's literally just turned half eleven and everyone's already queuing, but I'll show you when it comes because it's delicious. Okay, so we've been to this little bakery, oh my god, what have you done? <laughs> this is what they look like, I can open it, I can't open it, there you go, they're literally full to the bread, what's in it again, beef brisket, coleslaw, chimichurri sauce, can't think what else. Which one do you want? I don't know if there's one that we prefer. That looks like it's more full than last time. Which one do you want? Which one was on the bottom? That one. I think. I don't know. That one looks like it's got more. And then Tom also picked up some of these rocky roads. Mm -hmm. So, oh, it's just a big chunky rocky road. Yeah. So I'll have that after. Good morning. Happy Sunday. Sorry that I didn't really end the vlog yesterday, like speak to you in the evening. I just, I don't know, like what did we do yesterday? I'm trying to think when I last vlogged. Um, like I actually can't remember. Obviously I did some content in the morning and then what did we, I actually can't remember what we did. We watched Les Miserables, which is one of my favourite films. So we watched that in the evening, watched some Virgin River, some more drama happened. Honestly, if you haven't watched it, you need to watch it. I'm obsessed. I did our food shop. Um, I think, well, so today we're going to my mum's house about 2.30. She's doing like a little buffet situation. Uh, we're coming, my nan and granddad and my step nan and granddad are coming too. Um, so yeah we're all going around there about 2 30 so i don't know if we're gonna have dinner tonight kind of depends if she's doing the food at 2 30 or if it's like when we're coming around if we are gonna have dinner tonight we're gonna have salmon pasta we haven't had the um thai red curry but it's okay because the salmon's in the freezer so next week's meals is the salmon thai red curry pie and mash because we haven't had it for so long it's one of my favorites um and then we're gonna have some burgers with sweet potato fries and peas and we're gonna have lasagna and we're gonna have a tomato pasta bake I think that's everything yeah and then I'm gonna have salads for my lunches next week but like being in a little healthy vibe so you're gonna have some ham salads and you're gonna have the usual breakfast yogurt granola banana and strawberries I'm just making myself a cup of tea and Tom's just popping to the co-op to grab some cereals. So we feel like cereal, but we've literally only got cornflakes. I'm just really in the mood for it, and he doesn't really like cornflakes. So he's going to go to the co-op, see what he can find. I don't know if you can hear my voice, but I feel very unwell. I think I'm getting a cold or something. Um, so we're going to do some editing. I don't know if I'm going to shoot content or not, because it's kind of going to make it tight for time. Um, Tom's got a football game to watch at 12 o'clock, and it's literally going to end, and we're already going to be being late because of the football game. So I just don't think I'm going to bother. I'm debating booking a day off next week um, just to chill because obviously I've been so tired of all the overtime. Um, so I'm debating that whether to book a day off and I could do some like get ready with me's here and just post a bunch of those on Instagram and then obviously shoot some content on the weekend. Obviously I wanted to get my ears pierced but I haven't been able to go out because I felt really ill yesterday. I'm debating whether to go somewhere where my mum lives. But there's only Claire's. Like, is Claire's actually good? Like... Or is that mainly for children? I just don't know. I've never had them done for a while. So I'm not sure. So I'm going to think about it. But I do definitely want to get them done. Um, yeah. I'm going to go drink my cup of tea. I'm going to do some editing. And yeah. Because I need to catch up on this weekly vlog. But I'm excited for our little buffet tonight. We need to hoover downstairs. But the rest of the house is clean. I do need to clean the sinks and the toilets in all the bathrooms. I haven't done that. Can't lie. Um... So I'll probably try and do that maybe a bit later. I still kind of want to test out the Mark Hill curler though, the new one. So I've got some new barrels that I haven't tried before. So we could potentially try it today as well. But we'll do that when it comes to it. Okay, so it's currently half 12. Tom's football game is about to start. But what I wanted to focus on today, because I'm not doing my content, is vintage. So I 
can't remember if I said to you, yesterday I took a bunch of clothes to one of the clothes like little banks, all the stuff that kind of been on Vinted for ages or things I don't think I'm going to sell, I took them to charity. So I do like to try and take at least some of the clothes to charity because obviously it's good um, and I'm, it makes me feel good that I've, you know, supported a charity. But all the things I do want to sell, I want to bring my mirror up, put it here like I do sometimes when I'm doing content. And I'm going to take pictures and everything because apparently if you try things on for Vinted, you're more li likely to get some sales. I just want to get rid of everything so we can sort out the spare bedroom. So I'm just going to go ahead and do that while the game's on and watch some YouTube as well as edit a video. So that's my plan for the next hour. Okay, so it's 20 past one. I've done a lot of Vinted uploads. So feeling good about that. I'm just going to do some editing of my weekly vlog. And then I'm also going to do my skincare and then I'll come back to you because depending on what the time is, I'm not going to do my makeup but maybe we can test out the Mark Hill Curler together, test out one of the barrels. So that's my plan. So I'm just going to do a bit of this and then we can sort this hair out because it looks awful. Okay, so I've done a bunch of editing and now I want to do my hair. So this is the one I've obviously got, the Mark Hill in grey, the Jordan Lips going. I've put on the Mermaid Wave because I haven't used that for so long. Um, so I'm going to put my hair into a smaller... Um, section. Hold on, let me just grab and put a bunch of it up. We can test it out. I'm just trying to get a smaller section at the bottom, and then we can start. I've got my Give Me Cosmetics Heat Defense Spray, which is in Mango and Passion Fruit. It smells really nice. So we put that on to protect the hair. And then you can start. I haven't used this in so long, so I don't know what's going to happen. Um, I'll probably end up burning myself, knowing me. So I can't remember. I think if I have to... No, I think I need to start. Do I need to start from the top? I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> But yeah, I think I just do this and then I go down. I used to use this one all the time, um, but I haven't cut my hair in so long. Um, so it'll be interesting. I'm just I'm just doing it quickly. I'm not fussed by being like super curly, but just add a little something to the hair. This is what it like looks like. It gives this kind of like crimpy effect. Um, so yeah, but I'm, I think the colour of this is so pretty. The grey with the like chrome thingy. But obviously, it's nearly two o'clock. We're going to my mum's just after half two. Um, sorry, I'm facing this way because I'm trying to look in the mirror. Um, yeah, we're going to my mum's at half two. If she's going to do a buffet, I'll show you the little buffet. My nanny and granddad come in, and yeah, what was I actually going to say? <laughs> I can't remember what I was going to tell you. What was I going to say? I had something to say about that <laughs> before I started chatting rubbish. I don't even... Oh yeah, I'm giving my mum my other one of this because I've got a like the original which is like purple and black or something. And then any duplicates of like the ends, so, like I've got two of these now, I'll give her the duplicate because there's no point in me having two. And then at least she's got the wand and some... Um, thingies and then she can go and buy some more but I'm going to go do the rest of my hair and I'll show you when it's finished. Okay so the hair is curled it looks super cute obviously I'm not going to leave it like this I need to brush it through um, but I just want to do it like as last minute as I can so I'm waiting for Tom's football game to finish and then oh, I've got hairspray in my mouth I sprayed it with hairspray because my hair drops so quick and um, it was so easy and it looks really really cute so I'm going to put oil through my hair using my hands I'll come back to you when I'm doing that and then I think I'm going to put it half up, half down, because sometimes at the front it just looks a bit too much. So I think that's the plan, but I'll probably, I think the game finishes in like 10. So, yeah. Um, I'll show you my outfit in a minute, so it's really cute. Um, Tom said his game should hopefully finish in 10 minutes. He just told me it was going to be extra time, but I think someone's just scored, so hopefully not. So I'm just going to go ahead, put some oil on my hands, rub it in my palms, and just slowly, not slowly, carefully and gently like brush through the curls a little bit just to make them a little bit more you know 
cute but I just love the pick and mix weaver I think the curls turn up so nice like I've got so many different um t types if you want me to test out another barrel let me know because I've actually just missed doing my hair like I forget how much I love it yeah, so I've brushed it through and oh, it looks so cute. I'm going to wash it off and then we can put my hair like half up after. Okay, so this is how the hair is looking. Does she look cute? I wish you could like tell me. Oh, I just never know. Um, I think it looks quite cute. I think I like it. So I put a little scrunchie in and it just looks so curly. I feel like it reminds me of like my mum when I've seen pictures of her when she was younger. Her hair was like naturally like this. So... And like as a kid I had really really curly hair like up until like the age of four like my hair was like this like I came out with a thick head of hair and when I was like two three I had literally like a curly afro so I think that's why I like my curly hair so that's why I wish it stayed like I don't know why it went like it's not even straight it's just like a really annoying wave but yeah I'm gonna head downstairs because Tom said it's pretty much over I'm gonna spray myself with this essence belt number 19 I think this is the uh black orchid one I've just sprayed that all on my finger but yeah, let's go see my parents and my grandparents. This is the fit by the way, so I didn't show you. So I've got this little knitted jumper on from Pretty Little Thing, which is really, really cute. And then I've got these trousers on that I showed you, which I got from Hiccup. And it's just so comfy and cute. But yeah, this is the hair. I just, I don't know if I like it up or not. I'm just going to leave it because it's just going to get worse if I take it down. Let's go. Sorry for the abrupt ending of the vlog. It's currently Monday and I forgot to kind of film the rest of the day yesterday. Um, this is how my hair's turned out the day after. Really cute. Um, so I was at my mum's till like 7.30. We were there for hours. We had a really nice buffet. My nan had made like a chocolate brownie with raspberries on. She always makes it and it's so good. So we had some of that. And then we literally just came home, watched some Virgin River, had a shower and went to bed like we literally did nothing so there was just nothing to film we didn't have dinner like we just chilled but i hope you enjoyed the weekly vlog i didn't end up getting my ears pissed which is really sad but i'm going to get them done in the next weekly vlog i promise and we're going to do something exciting it's just i always end up getting ill or something happens and fingers crossed nothing happens but i hope you enjoyed anyway and i will see you in the next weekly vlog